Oh, I didn't expect you back so soon. <laughs> Blame was early. Steve's just dropped me off. Oh, I missed you. Have you got to her? So what's up with you and Steve, then? Why? What's his head? You two fell out. Oh, how dare he talk to you about it? Oh, I get it. That's why he was all keen to pick you up from the airport. Give you his side before you get home. Take a breath. We were sat in the car for half an hour. We could either, like, not mention it. Present for you. I'm sorry. I shouldn't take it out on you. Not much of a welcome home. So what's going on? We broke up. What, for good? Where we go? We're not going anywhere. We're staying here. In his pub? Not really thought this through, then. Look, love. We fell out, and... I suppose I don't know what's going to happen next. I thought you loved him. I thought we were all settled in that. I think he cheated on me. Steve would never do that. Yeah. That's what I thought. Ryan, all right? Fine. Look, I had to say something, didn't I? Could do some clean glasses. Mm. Be my guest. Hang on a minute. Uh, Becky, could you clean some glasses, please, instead of gossiping to them two? Them two? Oi! Don't have a go at her, just because you're too much of a wimp to ask me to do it. You all right, Michelle? Anything else I'm slacking with, you will let me know, won't you? What does Michelle like doing? She's got her favourite clothes. Oh. Look, this has gone far enough. You've had your fun. It's more than I have my fun. Well, you can do what you like, because Michelle's not going. Oh, are you feeling left out? I invite you, but you won't fit in. Not even in your spangly man boob tube. Why are you doing this? Because once you've had a few drinks down, you're going to well let it slip. Mmm, that's true. Yeah, I wouldn't make a spy me, you know. Never mind truth, Chugs. Inject me with six pints of snake bite and I spill my goats. <laughs> Literally, sometimes. Wait! <whistles> Michelle! Cheers. Me and Sean is off into town tomorrow and make a night of it. Do you fancy it? Yeah. I'd be well up for that, Tad. Ah, uh, no, sorry, somebody's got to work here. My mum's already booked the night off. Oh, well, you'll have to get your hands dirty then. Hey, have you been to that new club? It's just off, um... Uh, 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 it's about... You're on the road, sir. Am I? Oh. Oh, well, that's easily fixed. Oh, there we go, now I'm <clears throat> off it, and you... <gasps> look like you're working. Oh. Where's that club you said? Um, princess. Hello, Princess. You ready for your tea? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. So I'll do it. I do her meals. We agreed, no changes to a routine. Besides, she's not ready for burnt salad. It's not funny, Michelle. And neither was your little display earlier. Oh, what so? I'm not allowed out now. You don't own me, Steve. No, but I implore you. And you're down to work tomorrow night. Is that some sort of threat? Look, I'm sick of this. I've apologised. I've done everything I can to make it up to you. Well, I'm not doing it anymore. Oh, so the clock's ticking, is it? Forgive you by a certain date, I'll ship out. <laughs> Don't do that, sweetheart. Listen, it's OK, darling. Daddy and me were just talking. How long are you going to keep this up? You're upsetting Ryan. You're upsetting Amy. Don't lay this at my door. This is down to you, nobody else. Hey, how about pizza for tea, eh? Special treat for my brave little girl. Hmm. 